FNN. Headline News Update. Morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update. Uh, slightly mixed bag out there. That mix coming from the uh, Dow and the uh, New York Stock Exchange. They're both traded a little bit lower. The Dow is off 73 points. That's two tenths of a percent. Flat, basically, for the New York Stock Exchange. It's down about nine points. The S&P is also flat. It's up two points. NASDAQ 125. That's two tenths of a percent. Russell, a quarter of a percent. About five points. The semis are up two and three quarters percent, 69 points. They've been all over the board. Trannies are up a quarter percent as well. That's 34 points to the upside. Gold's back a buck. Silver's off a nickel. Lights recruiters up 223. Natural gas up 15 cents. And a 30 year treasury trade out 140.31. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES mini upper left hand corner. Yes, a new profile has formed. It is bearish in structure. So we've got new levels of support and resistance. The uh, resistance level is going to be at 43.2750. Support down at 41.77. The area to be watching is 42.63. If price closes below that, odds favor that price will make a run for the bottom of that profile, 41.77. Now, the spot volatility is still well below its 50-day exponential moving average. That is a bullish to a neutral for the S&P 500. The NQ also forming a new profile. Resistance there, 13.740. 13041 is support. It is also a bearish structured profile. That says we really want to watch that 13507 level. Again, a close below that would suggest a move down to the bottom of that profile. The U.S. dollar index is breaking out right now above resistance. That's the top of its daily profile. And that's at the 10658 level. That suggests a run up to 10839. Gold holding so far the support of the bottom of its daily profile at 1775. Silver trading just below the bottom of its daily profile, which is 1974. Price trade out at 1968. Lights recruit is uh, back inside its profile. Looks like it should go target its descending trend line. That descending trend line is somewhere in the 8750-ish type range out there at 8801. Natural gas taking on the resistance of a prior swing point as well as now the top of a new profile. So its resistance zone is between 956 and 965. You close above 965, it's off to the races to the upside. And the 30-year Treasury trying to get back inside its daily profile. To do that with the close today above 140.31 Right now, it is trading out at uh, 140 31. Gotta love that. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. But if you're off to start your Thursday, have a terrific one. Hey, tomorrow I'll be recording a show between 8 and 9. So please join me early for tea and crumpets out there. Have a terrific Thursday. Hopefully, we'll see you in just a few.